Today, it will be the day that we finish the brake system. This is the final install day and hopefully at the end of the video we will have the brake system all assembled and bleeded and ready to go. Stay tuned! Welcome to one more go for it video. Let's see if we can manage to finish all the job, install the flex pipes, install the, the brake calipers with the new rotors, with new brake pads, everything, and after that, fill the, the master cylinder uh, pump and uh, bleed all the system and uh, get enough pressure to, to have the system working and uh, the job done. Let's start. In one of the last videos, we remove the, the old flex pipes and uh, we protect the, the connection with this paper. So now that we have the support painted and uh, the line ready, uh, let's go and install the, the flex pipe. We have the new flex holes, we have the new clamp, so we will pass the, the pipe on the support, tight it and then uh, put the clamp on and this, this one will be ready. So, the first one, it's ready. We will unwrap the new rotor, brand new rotor, and install it on the hub. Now that we have the brake disc in place, let's bolt on the brake caliper on the on the flex pipe. It is now ready to receive the brake pads. I will use these Brembo pads. I should just slide in, in both sides. Okay. First this side because it has uh, a dent to go in that groove and now it can slide to the other side and the other side this part will be on the piston so it don't need to slide uh, in nothing. It is done. Let's now put the pins um, with the spring and the, 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 the outer retaining spring. Now the last piece is the retaining spring that holds the pins in place. Don't forget to reattach the the bracket that holds the, um, the signal wire. Now, finally, I will just tight all the assembly and uh, the first set will be, will be totally done. In the rear, I will use the the loop for the for the chain of my dirt bike i will use this to loop the internal parts of the mechanism of the handbrake uh, i think that this won't make a big mess and 
it stick really well to all these systems and hopefully it will last a long time in here. Brake disc. I don't know if I will be able to put the the bolts because it seemed to me that someone <laughs> broke the old ones inside and they are there pretty well so I will not be able to put the the bolt. we have all the system mounted we just need to fill the container with oil connect the pneumatic uh, bleeder and uh, and start to push uh, push the oil we'll start with the longest line that uh, it's the in, in my case it's the rear right one because I'm in Europe and it's a left-hand car so to this I take up the cap From the bleeder. I will open it totally because I want it to free flow. I connect the special adapter in here and now I will just put my container here in, in this <laughs> support that I made and connect it to the, to the compress there and it will be ready. The, the container is full of uh, DOT4 uh, brake fluid. Let's start to push it. Unfortunately guys, I lost the last footage from the, the, pro the procedure, but the, the bleeding of the brake system went smoothly. Uh, that pneumatic bleeder works well. Even if I, I think that I will try to get a different one, the one that uh, put pressure from uh, the, the master cylinder and push the fluid out for, to, to the bleeders. Uh, anyhow, the car, it's already stored here in place. It is breaking fine, so it was uh, an accomplished job and uh, the goal, it's, it's fulfilled. This part of the work on the car is complete now. The brake system is rebuilt and uh, ready to, to go for a lot of time, I hope. Uh, next, I, don't dis I didn't decide yet what, what is the system that I will address next, uh, but I will, give you, I will give you news soon. Uh, if you have some comments, leave it below, and uh, if you have any suggestions, about what to do next, just comment below and uh, let me know what you guys want to see next because all the systems will be reviewed. Thanks one more time for watching, I really hope you liked what you saw. Consider to subscribe to the channel, activate the notifications and uh, like the video and share it on your social networks. See you on the next one, bye!